All right, gang, Jason here for the love of tractors with another truck review. What, the truck? It's truck week, I guess, <laughs> here at for the love of tractors. So, um, you know, trucks trucks and farm go hand in hand, obviously. And, I mean, you know, big rigs rolling down the highway are super cool. And DCP does an incredible job on their toys as well. So uh, this is an ADM truck. This is a Mac Anthem, I believe, on the cab. Again, not the most truck fluent person. So you just have to bear with me on that. But um, if you live where I live in Illinois, ADM is everywhere. So you see these trucks pretty often. And uh, there's a big, obviously big ADM, uh, I think, you know, national or whatever, U U.S. headquarters is over in Decatur, world headquarters up in Chicago. We've got uh, in Quincy, Illinois, a, a pretty big soybean processing facility as well as an animal science facility. And then uh, down in our neck of the woods here, lots of... Uh, lots of smaller elevators owned by ADM or lots of elevators owned by ADM. So I just thought this would be cool to have on the display to show off to everybody. And uh, we'll just have it in the background somewhere. Or maybe it's going to make deliveries here to Dogtown occasionally with some ADM products. Maybe some soy diesel or something. I don't know. We'll see. Uh, just just kind of winging it there. So let's take a look at the trailer first. Um, so... The first thing I notice with this trailer is how heavy it is. This thing's heavy, heavy. Like so, this is all diecast. They did a pretty awesome job. Now, typical DCP fashion, uh, I guess I should say DCP first gear. Now, these will crank. All I got to turn those around. You can adjust your height um, of that sitting there, and uh, you know just make it kind of look how you want. Or if you're going to have it on the truck, obviously you're going to raise those up more. Uh, this has some really nice detail. So. Uh, one of the first things I actually noticed was the hoses going from the front down and around to the bottom of the trailer here. Super cool. Uh, obviously great uh, ladder detail, and you've got your side marker there uh, so that uh, nobody drives under your tanker truck on the highway, hopefully, fingers crossed. Got some nice detail up front with your fill cap, your platform, all that sort of thing up there. I will say one thing, and you can see, <laughs> fingerprints get all over this chrome, and yeah, well, so I'm, I'm cleaning this truck a lot, I have a feeling. Um, the ADM graphics are excellent on here. Um, they look really good, really crisp to me. Uh, same thing here on the back, if you can see the ADM graphics there. You've got all sorts of lights back here, your signals, your reverse light, your stops, uh, your DOT striping, you've got lights up here. Uh, you've even got like your, I don't know, is this a clean out? I assume this is maybe a clean out here uh, of some sorts, or, you know, maybe that's just where you dump. I don't know. Again, not a truck person necessarily. So uh, I think they're cool, but I don't have a ton of knowledge in them. So anyway, really uh, neat. Of course, DCP always does a nice job on their undercarriages. Sorry, I guess it helped if you could see them. But lots of detail on that undercarriage. Always, always pretty, pretty impressed by what they're doing. You can see... And if we kind of come up under, you can see your jacks and all that. Um, let's move it up to the front. Here is, you know, your hose work here. You've even got your, your um, come on, focus camera. You've even got your, your warning labels or your labels and all that stuff there. Uh, like I said, the hoses, boy, this is not focusing worth a darn. Sorry about that, guys. And it's the chrome that messes with my camera a little bit. And then, of course, you've got your fenders. And then your uh, mud flaps and things like that there. So pretty neat trailer in general there, I think. Now, let's take a look at this sweet Mac truck, huh? So, funny story. I had an Uncle Mac growing up, and he was a trucker, and I thought Mac trucks were named after him. So, <laughs> anyway, uh, just I always thought that was kind of funny. So, ADM truck gets a cool ADM logo on the side. I like these wheels and tires. They look cool, nice and detailed. You've got all your, your tanks and things like that. You've got your little, uh, you know, your little step here so that you can climb up, check things. Uh, the fifth hitch on this is a little wonky compared to other Speccast, uh, DCP, Speccast, gosh darn it, DCP fifth gear, sorry, Speccast, DCP fifth gear trucks I've I've handled, so I don't know, and it's actually, it's been a little tricky to get the trailer hooked up to it, in my opinion. All right, so this thing also has your uh, air hoses and things like that in the back. Those look cool, very good. I believe this is probably a def tank on the side, right? Am I, am I right on that truck, guys? I don't know. You have to correct me if I'm wrong. I know you will. 
Uh, interior is great here. You can see you've got two seats. And then uh, it, it's hard to see, but there is some nice detail in that cabin, uh, in the cab of this truck. Uh, got your, of course, you got your horns on top, your visor, mirrors, 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 mirrors. I do really like, by the way, the mirrors sticking out on the hood. I always thought that's that was cool. Um, neat that the Mac dog is gold. I, I just kind of stands out really well on this sort of gunmetal color. And then, uh, of course, being DCP, you can open it up, and we've got a nicely detailed engine up in there. So that's really cool. That looks great, doesn't it? I think it does. I like it a lot. Come over here, you can see the block a little better. And all of that. So super cool. I do love that the bumper is color matched to the truck. And all that. So uh, you get, so, get a nice set of lights on these Macs, too. They look really good on there. And, you know, just in general, grill's nice. Um, you got your Big Mac. Your Big Mac. Your, your The Big Mac logo there. And you just kind of keep on going around. Uh, back into the truck's pretty spartan, but, I mean, that's the way it should be, right? You just got you got a brake light and a reverser there. And, uh, of course, DCP always does a, a fair job uh, detailing. You've got your pumpkins and all that. You can see the trans. You can see your uh, oil pan and all that stuff up in there. So, pretty neat. Now, this, I don't know that this actually steers. I don't think it does, which is fine, because every DCP I've had that steers ends up breaking eventually if you play with it too much. So... Anyway, guys, so there is my, see, this is what I was saying about there. Got it. That was what I was saying about that, not wanting to hook up to that fifth hitch very well. Um, there's my Mac DCP hauler. This is my my find at a show. Uh, I think the list on this was like 115, 120. I think I ended up getting it for like 100. So that's just kind of what they're running right now to give you guys a, uh, an idea of what's what's out there. Um, anyway, hope you like this video. I know the truck thing's a little different than what we normally do, but um, got a couple trucks and I wanted to do some reviews on them. So anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Have yourselves an awesome day. Happy uh, tractor and truck hunting.